Welcome back everybody. Welcome to the last video of mine for the year of 2015. At the end of tonight, we will be ringing in the new year and welcome in 2016. So let's start with my finish nine by New Year's finale. The one product I actually did finish was the Summer Vanilla's Body Lotion. It was the coconut one by Bath and Body Works. I finished that. I really did like this scent. I would repurchase this scent if Bath and Body Works came back out with them during the summer. Now, the one, <laughs> this one was doomed. Doomed. Um, this is the Pomegranate Revealing Peel Off Mask by Freeman. This is all the progress I have made since I started this in August. Yeah. I don't enjoy it all the time. And when I do remember it, I'm only doing the T-zone. So it's not a lot. Um, I'm supposed to be able to do it two times a week or as often as needed. I really need to get on this one, but that's that. Then the St. Ives Cucumber and Elastin Eye and Face Stress Gel. I did make quite a bit of progress since the last update. I knew this one would not be finished. But I've gotten down past the curb here. So we're getting to the home stretch. So this one should be done maybe end of January. Sometime in February 2016. And then I have the Pepto Bright. I did make some more progress because... Last month it seemed like I didn't get anywhere. But I did make progress. Been using this product since the summer. So I say July maybe. So I, we're going to go into the new year with this. So it was a nice bang for my buck. I think it's 20 to $30 at Walgreens. And it's by Indeed Laboratories. It's the Pepto Bright. So... This was a nice product. I don't use it all over my face like they they say you're supposed to because I don't have discoloration all over my face. I have it in certain spots and it has worked, especially on new, you know, the newer ones they go they fade faster, newer dark marks or spots, but um the older product, the older spots, they are fading. You know, it just takes a little while. But I really do enjoy this and I will be buying that one again. Alright, so thank you for joining me on my journey to finish 9 by New Year's. I did get to complete 7 of my 9 items. Plus 1 from my finished 13 by Halloween. I will be looking to do a new project for 2016 to see what I can accomplish in Remove from my collection so they don't get old and dry out and then you have to repurchase new of something again. So you can try something new later. Alright, so thank you guys. I hope you have a happy new year and I wish you wealth, wisdom, happiness, prosperity into the new year and throughout. Peace.